So greetings from Pennsylvania once again, and I'm still here in South Central PA here in Michaud State Forest. We just got done exploring around an old iron furnace and followed the uh, furnace race, like you call it, to where we found a cool little, I'm not sure what it was, a little stone structure in the dam itself. But anyway, I'm in a different location here. I'll show you on the map in a moment, but it's called Walnut Bottom. My friend Dave from a Day Hike Dave, I was just filming with him uh, last week actually, he told me that I need to come here. I watched his video here. Um, there's some cool rock formations down here. He told me I need to come here, so here we are. I'll show you on the map. Got our map here. We're in the northern part of Michaud State Forest. Because so I was just over here at um, Big Pond, and I came back over here to Walnut Bottom. I think I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm parked right here. <laughs> so we're going to hike up this trail a bit, and there's see some rock formations that are pretty cool. And then later in another video, I might explore Chimney Rocks. It shows a little trail going up there. I know Dave said he tried to find it, and I kind of remember him doing it, but he wasn't really successful at finding what they're calling chimney rocks up there. So I might, after I'm done with this video, I might try that. That area should be um, up there somewhere. I, believe, I walked up the road a little bit, found a, what looks like a trail, so to know how much time I have, we might head up there then. And yes, that's called chimney rocks, but that's not the chimney rock that's here in Michaud State Forest. Um, more in the southern part, the Appalachian Trail goes long past a spot that's called Chimney Rock. It, that's a different location, so a little bit confusing. Anyway, let's let's go hiking. Let's find Walnut Bottom and these rocks. All right, so let's head down this way. Our little trail should curve over that way and our rock should be up that way. Yeah, it's, it's a unusually warm day today again, almost 60 degrees, but we'll take it. It is gonna cool down again. Just having a little bit of a, you know, winter heat wave, I guess you'd call it. So just a slight change of plans, I, I reparked. I was further down this road, I think it's called High Mountain Road. I realized where I was parked was not one of the gated roads that goes in, so the trail is all just kind of ended. So, reparked. And the other actual gated end of this road that I'm walking on had like private property signs around it and stuff, even though on the map it shows that it's kind of not, but anyway. We're all, I think we're good now. <laughs> I think I found the actual trail, the chimney rocks too. So we'll see. All right, let's find, let's find these rocks. <laughs> yes, this is much better. Where it was, the other site, there's no trail at all all of a sudden. I mean, my, I had a, my GPS would have told me where to go, but why do a bushwhack when you can follow this? So they should be on our left eventually up here. It doesn't look like an area that you'd find like huge rock formations, but it's on the map and my friend Dave found it. And people come back here to do like rock climbing too. All right, a fork in the trail. The main old road goes that way into an inviting little pine forest, but I see a well-traveled trail and I do see some gray blobs up there that would be rocks. So let's go this way. Oh. Yeah, this whole area is like a giant rock pile. Yeah. Okay. You can see all the rocks up there. Looks like you can a fork in the trail here, but let's go this way. Oh, yeah, wow. Keeps getting more impressive. Oh. Yeah. Whew. Maybe I should set you down. But of course, setting you down never really does it justice. All your seat is up to here. I'm looking way up there. Let me, uh, let me show you what I'm seeing. Yeah, that's, that's about as high as I am right there, but it just keeps 
it keeps going. It's there's another layer above that too. Wow. So yeah, we can explore that way. Let's go this way. I can remember Dave finding some like cave-like things up here and stuff like that. Oh, it's like a playground. You go up this way. Cool. Yeah, you could climb all the way up. I might later. I'm gonna scramble up here. Get a look out from the top. Pretty awesome. We might come back to that later. Let's check around down the bottom more yet. Or right, this will take us to the top too, I guess. If I wanted to. Maybe we'll just keep going this way. It's a bit. Oh, what's. Is that like a little cave thing over there? Yeah, check that out. Oh, just a little shelter cave. You could take refuge under there during a storm. But yeah, if it was raining and you need a spot out of the storm, you could uh, tuck back in here a little bit. Tuck back in here. Yeah. If it was the summertime, you just want to make sure there's no snakes in here. But yeah, it's actually kind of cozy right here. Let me show you my view. Oh, message. Got a little view for this cave looking out that way. Did scramble my way to the top. Oh, there's that big rock formation we were looking at earlier. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Well, I think that's where I was earlier, looking up. And get a different view of that. Yeah. Oh. Make me a little bit dizzy here. <laughs> Just gotta be careful. But yeah, earlier I was, I set the camera down that rock and I was literally looking up there and I was standing right there. Wow. That's the big rock. I think I can get over there too. Oh boy. <laughs> Pretty awesome though. Let me come get you. You're not too bad getting up here, just watch your step. Whee. I think in the summertime the view would be a little more different because you know all these trees here. It'd be a leafed in, I guess you could say. But yeah, it is a, it is a drop off, which I'm not gonna get too close to. <laughs> I'm not going out on that one. But yeah. Wow. In the wintertime, it's pretty awesome. So we I'm gonna head oh yeah, I'm gonna head back down and do some exploring all around up and through here. Looks like there's another one up there that you can stand up on. Yeah, you're right, Dave. It's a great place to come to. Yeah, if you haven't yet, you know, his channel is Day Hike Dave. Make sure you check him out. All right, we'll leave that overlook behind. Make our way back. This way, I think I can just jump down to this one. Um, uh, do we want to go? I think maybe I'll uh, stay at the top for now. Get over to this other, looks like some other spots over here. That we can get an overlook and then maybe head back down again over, over this way. We'll see. Getting breezy. 
Yeah, we were standing up there just a little while ago. I feel like I should set the camera down and get a view of that. It's me standing out there from here. That might be cool. Let's see if I can get that done. Yeah, that might be the better shot. Where are you? I can't see you. Oh, yep, yeah, there you are. Hopefully that worked out. There are a lot of trees in the way there, but we'll see how that turns out. Alright, let's keep exploring. Looks like you get down this way too. everywhere. Uh, oh, that looks like an interesting one over there. Not sure I can get to that one. Oh, it's like a sister rock to the one, oh, you can't see it anymore over there where we were. All right, we gotta try and get to that one. Uh, not sure about this one. Oh, that wind is picking up. Um, let's go over here. Ooh. That was a little tougher. You'd have to scramble up over that one. There's a little gap there and get over there. I don't know. We'll see. You know how I am about heights. I'm not going to do anything stupid up here. Let's see what it looks like, though. Yeah, I'm not doing that, unfortunately, I don't think. We're getting a little funky. Yeah, I can let that one, let that one go. Know your me. limits, folks, and respect them. You don't need to end up at the bottom of one of these. It'll be a while before someone ever found me. All right, let's uh, keep going, and then we'll, uh, like I said, get, find ways back to the bottom again here somehow. Yeah, these rocks just continue on. All the way down up there. Not sure how far we'll go, but uh, anyway. Yeah, we could get back down this way, but some of these rocks over here are calling to me. Like that one out there is like a giant pinnacle. I gotta get out there. Got some views. like a giant tooth coming up. Make our way down there. Uh, let's see what's the best way. I guess we'll... Um, I guess we'll just go down here. It looks like there's a trail head up right to it. Oh, this one, the dragon's tooth. I bet this is one of the rocks they try to climb. There's like the people with the, you know, what I'm talking about. Wow. Just a giant monolith. Uh, Yeah, this is easily like 30 feet tall, man. Or more. Wow. 
like a little cave down this way, not much of one. All right, where do we go from here? I guess I can try and squeeze through here, the bottom of the dragon's tooth, but where does this go? I'll have to turn you off for this, so squeeze my big belly through squeezed here. through there at the bottom of the massive dragon's tooth. Phew. And we'll keep going. Carefully make our way down here. Um, yeah, I think I can hop down. Hold on a second. Yep. Yeah, now we're at the base of the dragon's tooth. We're kind of like underneath it. All right. There's more rock formations scattered up through that way, but not as big as where we are. Pretty awesome place. There's no one else here. It's a Saturday afternoon now. I got the place to myself. Yeah, there's an interview of the dragon's tooth, I'll call it. Wow. Let's continue on. Another cool formation. Oh, this one has like a little cave-ish area underneath too. Yeah. That looks like someone's had a little fire here in the past. Yeah, I just noticed these, these white marks. I think these are where the people climb up. You can see that on camera right there. I'll show a little bit later, better view of it. Yeah. There's, uh, another spot to come hang out. Yeah, that goes in just a little bit. But you'd have to crawl. These white marks, that's what I'm pointing at. There's some there. Is there a spot? That's where, that's where these, these rock climbers, that's what they're climbing here. They're grabbing hold of the, the rocks at those places. You know, they, they uh, cover their hands with that powder. Is it talc powder? They try and climb this. Wow, it's like an overhang too. Yeah, not me. <laughs> All right. Let's head back this way. Yeah, so that one up there is the one I skipped out on trying to climb out to. So I had to pass on that one. I think our dragon's tooth is, yeah, it's back, back over there. So we're gonna try and make our way up along the base of these back to where we started. Still just making our way up. Once again, we're at the base of that one I pointed out just earlier. It's kind of fun just scrambling around through here too. Wow, it's like a little fortress down here. Uh, let's get up there. It looks like the main trail goes that way, but this just looks neat up here. Yeah, wow. Oh, is this a little cave too? Oh, just a little tiny thing. Goes in just a little bit there. Uh, okay, I'll head back down to that other trail. It's like a little fortress here, though. Looking out over your domain, you have like a little walled in protected area here. Let me back up and show this. Here's, here's the way in. Here's your little walled in fortified area. You could quit crawling there if you needed to. <laughs> it's like a little fortress. You can look out on your look out on your domain. Oh, squeeze through these. And we're heading back towards that 
one I was able to climb out onto or walk out onto. I think, I think that was the one I was up on earlier. I believe so. Uh, where do we go from here? Hey, hey, hey. All right, kind of made my way around a little bit. Yeah, just amazing. Could probably crawl up through there too if you wanted to, but I think I'll pass on that. Okay, I think this is where I was earlier. E was it? Yeah, I I think we were here earlier. I set the camera down while you're looking up there, yeah. So Well goodbye amazing rocks. They don't really have a name. It's called it's called Walnut Bottom on the map. I don't know. They should have a name. <laughs> Alright. Head back to the main trail which is just up here so that was definitely worth a visit like I had seen Dave's video when he was here and that was some time ago but as we all say the video just doesn't do it justice sometimes the scale and the, it's just amazing up there so definitely worth a visit worth coming back again with some friends sometime but yeah but just be careful when you're up there like I said know your limits respect them it's okay to challenge yourself at times, but just like here, I'm, I'm by myself. You know, if I get hurt by myself up there, it's not the greatest idea in the world. So anyway, I'm heading on to the next location. I think I'm gonna try to figure out what this chimney rocks is. Like I said, my friend Dave tried to find them, but the trail, I think the trail kind of ended on him and it, yeah, but we'll see what we can do. All right, hopefully, thanks for coming off folks. Hopefully we'll see you on the next one. Maybe at Chimney Rocks.